And time's up for principals to cut education spending in their schools by $17 million. Superintendent Jesus draws deadline to turn in a balanced budget passed just an hour ago and just in time because school starts in less than two weeks. And those cuts could still lead to the teacher strike that unions have been warning about really since the legislative session. And 13 Action News reporter Sean Delancey right now is here to exactly explain uh, how that is even possible, Sean. Uh, Carla Todd principals had to cut their budgets by 98 bucks a student and that quickly adds up. Middle school principals had to chop roughly six million dollars from their schools and it's even more expensive for high schools. They had to find just shy of 11 million. Superintendent Jesus Jara set this deadline last Wednesday when he re reversed a decision to eliminate all 170 dean positions in the school district. Instead, Jara directed principals to make the necessary cuts. Dean's Union Executive Director Stephen Augsburger says that Dean's positions could still be eliminated by principals, but most could now keep their jobs. The district needed this cash to afford a promised 3% raise for teachers, which they will get, but the teachers union is still threatening a strike. CCEA President John Villardita says if any of the principals cuts affect their teachers positions, class sizes or class resources, they will call a district wide strike at the beginning of the year and these budgets will take some time for the district to process and we are digging for details including how many deans ended up on the chopping block and how your kid could be affected. We'll bring you those as soon as we have them. Sean Delancey, 13 Action News. All right, Sean, thank you.